To set up our GNSS, we select our GNSS tile. Then we select Edit. The layout of this menu structure may vary depending on the receiver you are connected to. Regardless, the functionality of each option remains the same. When using the XEN 2050, you have the option of selecting the antenna type that is connected to your GPS receiver, the TM200. Generally, this will be the AG25. This step is not necessary when using a NAV900 or NAV500 with the XEN display. To use uncorrected or free position information from the GNSS constellations, you need to set your receiver to autonomous. The next option you have in setup, regardless of correction type, is position quality. By default, this is set to favour accuracy. Favour accuracy will ensure that your receiver is working at the optimum accuracy possible. It may result in longer convergence times or potential dropouts around trees. If this is the case, you cut the options of balance quality or favour availability. Selecting favour availability may reduce convergence times as well as making the receiver a little more robust in harsh conditions. This will ensure that the operator can have the most uptime. However, it is a trade-off. This has a potential for reduced accuracy. Balance quality is a trade-off between the accuracy and the availability settings. MSS mode limits the band on which the L1 and L2 frequencies are listened to. This should be set to automatic in our region or wideband. If narrow band is selected, you may experience issues with the RTX frequency as well as XFIL and XFIL Premium. This is only a UI option when using a NAV900 or NAV500 receiver. If using the XEN 2050 and a TM200 receiver, this is a physical switch present on the AG25 antenna. Lastly, when using a NAV500 and NAV900 receiver, you have the ability of disabling and enabling different constellations. We recommend that you run with all constellations to give you the most available satellites. Once you have finished configuring the settings, be sure to press the save button to exit out of the page. Your GNSS tile should now update to the configured accuracy of your display. Entering diagnostics allows you to view the status of your receiver. This will display information such as satellites used, the correction type that the system is currently set to, the correction source that it is using for that correction type, and the correction status. You can also quickly access the settings to change the position quality from favour availability to favour accuracy or balance quality.